Um, good afternoon, World President. You are Livyu Krishan. You are the World President of the World Union of Karate, and you've come from Romania. That's right. Yes, yes, it's true. And have you been in Sheffield before? Yes, I have uh, been for three times. I think this is the fourth time. Yeah, and I love Sheffield. It's a very, very nice city. Are we good at karate? Of course, I'm, I came here just uh, for this reason because here it's a very high level of karate, and uh, for my friend Peter also, it's a fantastic uh, host. And he's organizing uh, really perfect uh, all the competitions. Yeah, this is Peter Allen, who is the European president, and you've, you've, you've brought this championship to the EIS because everything's here for you, basically, isn't it? Yeah, everything is the largest indoor, well, athletic arena in the UK. And the reason we picked Sheffield is, uh, one, because we also like Sheffield, and um, it's got the infrastructure to take the ten areas that we need to run a successful championship. So, Livyu, what, what are the um, competitors doing over the next couple of days, then? Uh, we'll, we shall have today and tomorrow the registrations and uh, also the technical seminars with masters and the ma technical seminars for coaches as well. And the referees must be trained and tested, selected, of course, for the, the days of the championship. that will be Friday, Saturday and Sunday. And on Sunday we shall have only finals. It will be the, let's say, most exciting uh, day. Best for sure, uh, we shall have the categories that uh, will attract uh, more spectators that will be the best of the best, we say. That is a selection of the champions that will fight together for the Supreme Team title. So the, um, the flag's all being hung out as we speak. I can see, it's that Swedish flag that I can see closest to us. Ukraine. Um, Ukraine, oh dear. Well, oh, geography. Oh, it. <laughs> geography lesson. So there's, there's basically, there's people from all over the world, aren't yes. there? for all the Europe, because Europe. it's the European Championship. Yeah. And up to now we have registered 21 countries. And it's possible to have uh, some more because we don't know exactly if some of the countries got visa or not. But we are waiting today and tomorrow, of course, we finish the registrations. And your country, Romania, even though uh, obviously you're impartial as the president, but your country are very, very good at this, aren't you? In karate, in my federation, I think uh, everything is going well. And <laughs> we had a lot of competitors here and uh, we do hope that uh, we shall try at least to be on the podium here because up to now we, we are world world champion and European champion and today, and not today, the Friday, Saturday and Sunday will be very hard days for us. Peter's just told me he's quite jealous of his <laughs> record actually. Yes, they, well, they have set the standard. Uh, they're, they're world champions uh, in Romania, by views group. And, uh, by having this standard, we have to make my athletes reach that standard. So we've been working hard, very, very hard over the last two years to try and uh, emulate his 28 goals and uh, and hopefully we will be on the, the podium in first place. <laughs> I think we might have but, a fight on our hands. Uh, <laughs> no, he's, he's, my, he's my best friend and, uh, and, and I wish, wish Romania and all the countries taking part, all the federations taking part, the best of luck. They, it, it's a fantastic city to hold our championships in and um, it's going to be a spectacle it, and we're hoping for a, well we do know now we're going to get a live broadcast on uh, at the open ceremony on Thursday so uh, we're looking forward to this and hoping that many people tune in and, uh, and watch watch karate for what it's meant what it's for you know uh, friendships and how big is karate in this country and how well funded is it um, it's not very it's not funded by uh, at all because karate is not recognized yet as a governing body but uh, the, the current what we class as our recognized governing body the English Karate Council is is in talks with um, uh, Sport England to become recognized so we're our applications are, are going in and uh, we're hopeful that this time next year we will have uh, um, a governing body recognition from Sports England which so, at some point if the funding's there we, we may get funded but it, for us it's not about funding it's about recognition taking part and friendships in Europe with other countries that's what that's what that's what it's about for us there is presumably in terms of because people get a bit confused about the different martial arts <laughs> don't they and yeah. I, I mean there, there are quite a lot of different martial arts presumably you're all competing for funding and competing for interest are you well yeah I mean there's in the councils in various boroughs like Sheffield my hometown Bury and Manchester Bury they, they all have funding streams which which clubs can tap into uh, they have club mark which is a mark that Sports England use for, which is a funding stream, uh, but to get this sort of funding, 
uh, you have to belong to a governing body and the current governing body for England is the English Karate Council and if people join the English Karate Council they have a good chance of getting funding for their sport. So you're on over the next few days, people can yes. come along and see you if they wish. Yes. Uh, we bang out of time, can I get you a, uh, can I get a shout from you uh, after <laughs> yes. three? One, two, three. Yeah! Yeah! yeah. Oh, yeah. that's good, isn't it, Roni? How was that? <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like ear. Ear! Ear! Thank you very much.